Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe now if you do enjoy our content. Hey boys, another review for you today. Today we're looking at the Fabian Centonze 91 Striker uh, Shapeshifter card. Shifted from the right back position to a striker, which is a little bit interesting, I guess. I don't know how well the uh, card would play, to be honest. Uh, he has four star skills and a four star weak foot with high medium work rates and a lean body type. So the big plus there being the lean body type for sure. Uh, does play in uh, the league one with FC Mets and is a French international. Don't think he's represented though. Uh, we have four objectives with this card. So the dynamic defender, the French perfectionist, the swing it in and the league one specialist. So you need to assist with the defender, score four outside of the box goals and assist a goal with a cross, as well as winning eight matches, all in squad battles or in rivals. So good luck with those guys. Could be a little bit painful at this time of the year, depending on your division. Again, best wishes with those. Uh, as far as traits go, just the one trait for this card, and that is a speed dribbler, which could be quite handy. I can't imagine anyone's going to use this card on the inside position. Probably going to use it outside somewhere in a 3-5-2 or a 5-3-2, maybe a 4-4-2. Uh, pace, 93 overall with 94 acceleration and 93 sprint speed. So, I mean, a good even cut, but not really that fancy at this point of the year. Uh, over to the shooting, we have a card that has 91 overall shooting with 94 positioning, uh, 92 finishing, 92 shot power, 92 long shots, uh, volleys and penalties at 76 and 77 so if you do get into a shooting position with this card it could be quite handy nothing too spectacular though passing uh overall passing at 88 with vision at 86 and curve at 90 crossing at 95 if you do use in the wide position uh short passing at 90 and long passing at 83 so again nothing too fancy but this is a free card of course into dribbling, 91 overall dribbling with 95 agility and 93 balance, which is a really good cut there. Uh, reactions at 89, ball control 91, dribbling at 90 and composure at 93. So if you do get into the box with this card, it could be quite handy with the uh, shooting stats as well. Alrighty, from dribbling we move into defending. Uh, what makes this card usable is the defending at 80, I guess. You've got three stats above 80 or at 80, and they are interceptions, heading awareness, and defensive awareness. Uh, standing and sliding tackle are at 79 and 78, respectively, as well. So nothing too fancy, but allows the card to be usable. Physicality at 86 with jumping 82, stamina 99, which is quite standard these days. Uh, strength and aggression around the low 80s. Uh, we strength at 82 and aggression at 80, of course. Uh, into the chem styles that I think would be used useful for this card, I guess, um, if you are going to use the card. I would suggest a Hawk or an Engine, depending on where you're going to play the card. Um, you could also use an Anchor, I guess, if you are going to play it out wide in, in more of a defensive role, uh, depending on your instructions, of course, that you do place on the card. Um, I've already mentioned in the video, but I would be playing this card out wide. Definitely not a card for the middle, unless you're doing League on objectives and you don't have anything else to use. Um, definitely not a foot champs card at this stage. Um, some similar players shown just there in Kongu, Hullet, um, and some others. I dare say the other ones would be a better option, but they do come at a hefty price. That's all I have for you today on Chen Tonze, guys. Let us know if you are going to complete the card and if you do, how you do fare with it. Good luck, best wishes. We'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe now.